So to show you how that process works in real time, I have my project here which is set up. I've just called it 999 so it's at the end of all my projects because I like to number them. It's an analysis only project. So if I double click on it you can see I've only got two files in there at the moment because I put them in and take them out whenever I need to run an analysis. So if I go to my Windows Explorer, let's just assume I've got these three files that I want to analyze. So I just drag them down here, drop them into here, add a source files. My three files have now been added. So I can select my files, batch tasks, do an analysis only, and finish. Let's run through, does the analysis on those files, and it's done. If I now click on my reports view, I have the, uh, once, once report loads here, I have a translation count, which is the total number of, or it gives me the total number of files, the segments, the words, the characters, and then breaks it down for each of those individual files. If I look at the analysis for those files, in there I get the full analysis, which is based on um, all the things you'd normally expect to see. So pretty, there were small files, but you get the idea. It was pretty straightforward, very easy to use, and not very easy to use, and not really any more complicated than it was in Trados 2007. Now, if I want to save that particular file, or oh, just to show you the other thing, I can also group it by report types or by languages if you're mixing it, mix and matching. If I want to save that file, I can click on Save As, and this brings me up an option to save it as an Excel file an HTML file, an MHT file, or an XML file, depending on what my use case is that I want to use it for. So those are some useful options you didn't get with Tridus 2007. You can also take a look at a print preview, so you can see what the actual report looks like anyway. So it covers three pages, that particular one. Or you can just print it straight off. So pretty straightforward, pretty easy to be able to get a report out of Studio without necessarily creating a project every time, just based on one project that you have set up just for dropping files in.